Ew, Pisces and cross wishes. This is your extended reading for November of this current year, right? Pisces, this is for the sign and sun, moon, rising, and the Venus. Also Saturn, Jupiter, and Mars. So please check your charts, right? Right. If this resonates with you, cool. If not, you do. Boop your nose. What do you There's no point about worrying about shit. They got nothing to do with you and ain't none of your damn business, right? Right. So. Pisces and cross watches. <sighs> Had to put my cigarette out. My bad. So your current situation with the reading as well as the person you're dealing with could be an earth sign who uh, isn't really um, looking into the waters to see the future. They're not really divinating. They got like this, uh, uh, I am the producer. I produce it or I am the director or whatever. I don't, I don't know. This person's got money, but they ain't got foresight. I feel like. What should be aware, made aware in this situation? There's a judgment call that someone is not the best villain. In fact, their alignment's out of check, I feel like. To the point where they just look crazy and it's driving them nuts. It's just like, what the fuck do I have to do? What do I have to do? I don't know. I don't know. Dude, you know like, um, their energy or the situation's energy, this magician, needs to take a good hard look at themselves in the mirror and remember who the fuck they are. You know, they need to recognize who they are and all the scars they've created and all the things they've done, right? And over here, the desire, right? Coming out of illusions that make you an emotional puppet. But I feel like this person's struggling on whether or not to cut it out or not. Because there might be somebody who cuts it out for them. Alright. Pisces and cross watchers, let's see. What is the next move? For this person or the scenario. Ten of Wands reverse coming out of a burden. Or being overburdened because they won't let the shit go. One of the two. Either or, you know. Could be you, could be them. Uh, what blocks them? Queen of Swords reverse. They really don't have the most logical sense to them. In fact, they start they swing away, Meryl, honestly. Um want to be aware of this person like screaming rather than taking action they'll sit on their flea their blood-sucking flea and just holler at shit right <clears throat> or that could be you doing that taking that energy you know because uh someone might be sick of some unfairness from a fire sign could be leo sag aries there's also this motherfucker here he's fire so it definitely could be a fire sign and probably they're so completely unfair Pisces and Cross Watcher. This person might even be aware of it, I think. I, I like I, I just started doing extended, so I really don't remember. And I haven't uploaded your guys yet or given you a title, so I can't remember exactly what it is about. Oh, I thought there was my boo. Okay. What's the result of all this? Someone needing to weigh their options out. Or someone going to weigh their options out. Okay, so Pisces and Cross Watchers. Let us see. What's the next move? Ten of Wands reverse. Either they're overburdened or they're trying to end burden because they're tired of carrying that shit, right? You know. Yeah, because they're just, like, it, 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 they think about it, so, it, like, they, they're, they're tired of thinking about it. They think about it a lot, and it's just, like, I'm done with thinking about this shit. When will it end? They're still sad about it, though. But they're tired of lingering on it, Pisces and Crosswatcher. It's just like, fuck this shit, I'm out. Three Swords Energy could also have been out with a third party, too, or just disappointments in general. You know? Oh, okay. Um, they feel pretty defeated by it, too. Like, no matter how much they fought, like, there wasn't a point. Hell, there aren't even people here to fight. It's just the sticks on the ground. No one's even present. Like, who was there to fight to begin with, I feel like, I should say? Pisces and Cross Watcher.
see. Well, technically, yeah. Uh, I'll lay two down. Fuck it. Yeah, they want to reach out to somebody who they... I feel like someone did more work than the other. Honestly. I feel like someone did a lot more work than the other person. They just kind of stood there. And watch the person do whatever. But I don't know if that's what that person thinks that they were doing. Or if that's the other person was doing. Because I almost feel like Ghost Dude. No, yeah. Ghost Dude was the person doing all of the work. That's the person they're trying to reach out to. The person trying to reach out to Ghost Dude didn't do a dick. They just sat there with a book being like, no, it goes like this. Like, anybody fucking cares. Mm. Nobody asked. <laughs> all right. What blocks this person? Queen of Swords reverse. This person gets erratic. They lose their shit. They get illogical. They just cut people. For no reason. Just because someone made them feel something I feel like. This person doesn't even know that they're doing it to themselves either. They're so blind. Oh, this person's blind. This person is extremely blind. I see using cross watcher. I almost called you cancer, so maybe there's a cancer involved here. But... Even by the eclipses, they still won't get it. They still don't get it. They don't see that they set themselves up. Could be an air sign, but it doesn't have to be. Ugh. And they, I feel like they're confused about where to go with things, too. Or at least what direction they're going in. Mind you, this could also just be a person. Who's blocking someone else. Or blocking whoever this queer is in this Pisces and Crosswatch. This could just be a random person. Or someone who they know is crazy. And this person could be blocking whoever this is, you know. Because they in love and they've been in this shit for a really, 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 really long time. It's like an old relationship or something. Like, it works. It works. Um, as long as someone doesn't go near disaster. <laughs> uh, okay, hold on a second. What's the disaster? I'm curious now. Well, we won't use these. We'll use these. What's the disaster? Well, definitely has something to do with lacking intuition. And, yeah, lacking intuition about being like, I don't care if they can stay out there. That's that person's problem, but I think they're addicted to, like, waiting for nothing that way um they don't have to choose between the real world and the world they've created but um it causes them to lack the ability to take action against something um that uh when you come here they really shouldn't even be afraid of coo -coo, coo -choo -choo. So what, what, what is this? What is this? What is this? Somebody needs to dump their emotion now, but like I said, there's a crazy bitch right here who, you know... Mm. She you know when someone keeps giving into the situation, but every time they do, it's like an enabling behavior. It's like, um, you're just taking a little bit like this person, like this person isn't gonna give you a whole fucking cookie. They're not gonna give you a whole coin. It's gonna be a chocolate covered like coin thing, a chocolate coin, and then they walk away with the real shit and and leave an able like this person gives you substitutes for a real fucking thing. Pisces and cross watchers. You love this person, or they love you, or this is like some other person in the fucking middle, right? Who does not seem to understand. They're almost sabotaging themselves by not understanding that they don't have to go anywhere. Or maybe they should leave, <laughs> despite how they feel about somebody. That could be the issue, too. Let's see. Be wary of the person who, like, acts like a bloodsucker, but only the screams. I found this whole, like, show called The... Curlian frequency on Netflix. I'm so glad Netflix has people to translate shows from different countries and shit because that's really helpful. Um, 
even though I would like to hear the language in order to see if I can try to learn it. So I used to do that shit a lot of the time as a kid. But it's really um, cool. I just thought about that. It's actually the story about the blood suckers. Uh, this person constantly goes in with some shit manners. Look at that nonsense. Like, going in shouting, saying some fucking nonsense, you know. Blah, 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 blah. Like, it, it just screams from where they're at, but they won't do anything about it. They got a bad attitude about shit, Pisces and Crosswatcher. Um, but they always want to resurrect the dead and start again. They especially have an attitude about that, you know. So, let's see... And that helps them maintain control. That's nice. Mm. This person will start in a fucking argument just so they like and search it over again and then feel better about it because it's just like I made this happen. Yeah, weird shit, right? Well, have, what's the results of all this? Two of Pentacles, weighing some shit out. They're looking over all this, but they got something up here. Um, probably an inkling that their judgment's off, I would hope. Because, like, they're realizing, like, definitely someone's being played as a puppet. Thank you, Lulu. I appreciate that. Um, but they need to make the decision on whether or not they're going to take the sword from the angel and cut that shit out. It's like they're having trouble understanding, you know, um. You can do different things. You don't have to keep doing the same thing all the time. Because, like, this is starting to bother them now. Like, it's the awareness. It's like someone... It's like... It's like someone keeps taking their cars to different mechanics. And then, like, they get mad because the mechanics all tell them the exact same problem with the fucking car. It's just like, do you want the car fixed? Or are you just going to keep taking it to everybody else and, like, spend your money to not hear shit, you know? That's what this reminds me of. Uh, they're all in the shadow about how pissed off they are. They're pretty selfish. They're, they're pretty in the dark about how selfish they are. Because they're extremely selfish. But I don't feel like they're even aware of what... Of how bad they are. I mean, I feel like you would have to record a motherfucker in order for them to understand how they're acting. Because, you know, like, it, it, you know, if you record somebody and they're not paying attention and they act normal and, like, you capture what the fuck they do and how they treat people, that can be extremely shocking because it's so much different to see how you behave when you, you aren't paying attention, when you don't know you're being observed in regard, it, you act, it's way different to see how you are as a person versus actually being the person you know because you like i remember this one time when i was getting ready for uh mobilizing for afghanistan right i had taken videos of all these different soldiers and one of the ncos came over and like they happened to see themselves on the video and they watched that video and they were just like is that really how i come off to people I would have never known that if I hadn't sat and watched them. It, it was just a weird thing for me. Because it's just like, do people really not realize how they behave? But um, a 9 out of 10, you're so comfortable with yourself, you wouldn't even pay attention. It, but it's when you see yourself, because it's so much more different when you see yourself, that riddles a motherfucker. So if you need to record somebody to show who they are, go ahead and do that. <laughs> Hell, they try to do that to you, Pisces and Crosswatcher. They might actually catch themselves acting worse than you and then like realizing what the fuck they're doing that's a lot but we'll go with it uh yeah they like to run away and then act like they fell asleep on the horse just to forgot to deliver everything because it helps them make them feel like a victor um they will take every fucking thing they will not even leave you a turtle you know but then they'll feel all sad about it and have a hard time getting over the shit because there was actually love here. It's just someone decided to, you know, snub their nose at a motherfucker and entertain their own shit. But that shit's caused them a long, hard journey that tore up a lot of their fucking clothes and are just now seeing the light and not delivering a cup and being in the shadows about your, about your emotions and 
information and whatnot that doesn't cut it anymore like you're not a child like you're not your parents and whatnot like that's not going to work anymore this person might end up actually taking their own kind of spiritual journey because it's faded time for them to do that they just have to sneak away from all the everybody else's shit they have to sneak away from everybody else in order to do this stuff or they feel like they got to be deceptive and hide from having to do this too so that's what they're mad about. That's what they're in the shadow about. That's what's aggravating this person. They don't... Like, this person knows that they're supposed to change and they're not going to do it. That's the problem here. Pisces and Crosswatchers. They don't want to change. Um, This is like a person who says that they can't when in reality the word that they should be using is won't. You know, like my father, a Libra, he, um... You know, Libras are in, in late Libras are cardinals signs much like Capricorn is, which is what I am. There's Libra, Cancer... Aries and Capricorn and those four are the Cardinals those are the ones that make their presence known as soon as they walk in the room without even having to do anything they can just walk in and everyone notices who they are Cardinal signs have that kind of power you know um my father is a Libra and Libra deals more with like justice you know weighing out the pros and cons has nothing to do with fairness right we're Capricorn we, we're more of the underworld the underbelly so we deal more with fairness you know but justice really has nothing to do with fairness and whatnot so my father, he always thought it was justified to say, you know, um, a person who says can't a lot is a person who just is too, how did, how the fuck, say? my father used to say something along the lines of like a person who says can't is just looking for an ex excuse to say I won't or uh, something like that. Like can't is like an excuse for won't or something like that. I, I need to ask him exactly what that means but it basically or exactly what he says but it's basically like you know people um often say can't in a situation where it's really not something that's impossible um it's more along the lines of is they won't do it because he takes it to it like you know a motherfucker will just like um say bye bye to someone from back in the day and then be burdened by that shit like look at the look at the stone statue and then just watching him, like, and he's carrying all the sticks and shit. It's just like, oh, man, I got another bundle to carry, right? This is a person who um, says I can't a lot, the things that they can do. It's just they don't want to do it. This is a person who can easily change. And they recognize they need to change, but it's agitating their fucking demons and shit. It's just like, I don't want to do this shit. You know, they're struggling to um, actually grow, I feel like, too. Because... This angel has this sword right here. It's just like, it's right here. Anytime you want it, this person's like, no, I can't do it. You know, but it's like, it's not that you can't, you just won't. Um, if you couldn't do it, it wouldn't be presented to you time and time again, I feel like, with this person, Cancer and Cross Watcher. You know, you can only say that you can't do something so many times, but if it keeps getting thrown in your face or, you know, I mean, like, that's what I feel like with this person. It's just like, they know. They need to look in the mirror and look at themselves and recognize who they are. They know that their judgment's fucked up about how they're fucking aligned. They can get their shit going, but they refuse to have the foresight to know that any of this shit keeps happening. And then they're sitting here saying that they can't when really they're using a coward's answer of won't. They won't do this. They won't act out in this way. They won't change their ways. They won't listen to people who come up and tell them the, like, shit that they know is a problem. Problem. like they're a problem like this other person right here there's probably a second person who's gone crazy because um they love somebody but that somebody just doesn't love them enough like you know it doesn't matter how much you love somebody it, it, you know like if you're not enough you're not enough and I, I think that's what that's driving this person crazy it's just like am i not enough for you to like try to do something for yourself or i don't know it's like they do something to this person Whoever the couple, this, this queen of um, swords right here. I feel like they do something to her and that's what's fucking them up the most. It's almost like a, um, a repeat record. I'm not sure. Mind you, you also have, like, I don't know. Like, is that the problem with the person who keeps trying to come in and ruin your shit? Because you have that, like, uh, for a minute now. Like, well, you guys, it seemed like you've been in a third party for, like, at least 
like almost two years since I started doing this shit. You know, like you love somebody, you do, you do. But it's almost like you feel like um, you can't produce what they need, or maybe they make that feel that way with you or whatever, right? Make somebody feeling paranoid, needing to be guarded, and all that shit. Even though they really know the truth of the situation. However, taking any action could lead to something disastrous. And there could be secrets revealed that someone's been guarding against for a very long time. Probably something to do with a bitch, because she's on the both of these cards right here. Which were the last two cards I read. Secrets come out that someone's been guarding something. It definitely could be dealing with a mistress. And someone leading the way. Pisces, it could have been you who's a mistress or whoever else. I'm not sure. Anyway, back to this reading. <sighs> oh my god. First off, this bitch senses it. Esther knows. Esther can smell that shit in the fucking air. Esther's just taking a deep breath and being like, okay. Tower moments coming, you know, like, it, that's all the way hidden back here. There's still some shit to go through. But this person's all upset and shit. Because they're waiting for somebody or something to come back. So they gotta apologize? What does that even mean, Pisces? What, what the fuck does that mean? Someone's waiting for someone to come back after their sneaky adventures? After they've been thieving and shit? Hmm. And it's the King of Cups, too. I mean, like, it looks just like him in the other one. Dressed the same, all in blue, looking pissy. No reason whatsoever, but it's there. Um, he's all upset because, like, he's waiting for someone to come back in from sneaky nature. It's probably you, um, Pisces and Crosswalker, you're waiting for someone to come back or something. I don't know. I'm not sure. We'll figure it out, though. Would you clarify him, right? Right. So. Let's see. Yeah. I think I'm going to make some eggs. Eggs sound delicious. I'm going to make all the bacon because the kids like bacon. I will eat a significant portion of bacon. That is the tax. <laughs> Not really. The kids will get more of it than I will. Anyway. Um, what's the next move for the situation or this person? I really feel like this is a person who, um, I really feel like whoever you're dealing with, Pisces and Crosswatcher, they're just, mm, they're just, they are just. So let's see. Well, they're definitely not going to do anything to fix the situation, that's for sure. In fact, they come in just to make things worse. This person likes to argue. Or some shit. I don't know. They, this person, I feel like mm, this person knows what they're doing. Uh, they fuck up someone else's day because they don't know what they're doing, though. Like, they have no idea where the fuck they're going. They don't know how to Google that shit. They're kind of lost, honestly. More than anything. Could also be with a cancer, too. But they come bugging somebody else because they're kind of blocked in themselves. Like, I mean, they, they, like they're very much so. Very much so. Ugh. That's why they can't manifest shit. And that's why things keep going fucked up for him, too. Pisces and Crosswatcher. It's like, um... Like, purposely being unkind is what's fucking him up. It's making me wonder if they're um, dealing with a divine person or a divine being or something. Because, like... I'm just saying, that's the only time when it feels like that energy's right. It's just like, um... If, you, if you're fucking with the person and, like... Things start to go a little weird or sour or whatnot, you might be fucking with a divine being and the universe might not like that.
You know, it sounds most of us here. And most of us end up getting killed, you know, whatever. Okay. What blocks this person? Well, number one, they're crazy. Or it's somebody who's crazy. Um, person might not see that they're doing shit to themselves. <sighs> Lulu. Lou! <laughs> you crazy lady, you. Get down. Go on. Down. Thank you. Messing up my camera and such, you crazy pooch, you. I think she needs out. <laughs> She'll be fine. Yeah. Let's see. Hmm. Hmm. Well, someone will keep publicating this motherfucker just to keep it uh, going. Be like, I love you because they don't want nothing to end. They're trying to endure, it seems like. This is like. Do you need to have fun? No. I'm, I'm building something. You're building something. Yeah. Build me a horse that I can ride. That's an animal. Well, you say you're building something. I'm building a house. Make it look like a horse. <laughs> Here, one more. I'll do more, I guess. Um. Yeah, someone will embrace this bullshit. Someone's crazy enough to embrace this bullshit. Keep carrying the swords for somebody else. And then keep their mouth shut. You know, I don't like that. Hmm. <laughs> That's what blocks this person? This where like this individual right here. Um, this is not the queer. This is not the person who I've been talking about this entire time. This is somebody else. Um, could be the person you're dealing with. They could be dealing with you, Pisces and the Cross Watcher. But this person right here, they're a block for whoever this is. And the way that they're blocking them is they're crazy enough to deal with the horse shit. Okay, they're crazy enough to just sit there and take it. And that is what's blocking this person's energy. That's why they're in this whole judgment of realizing that, you know, they can't keep hiding from not changing what they're doing or who they are anymore. Like, that's the problem. It's like... <laughs> <laughs> this person is blocked because the, mother, uh, no, because the other motherfucker is just like, oh, I'll get used to it. That's literally... <laughs> oh my goodness. Uh, what to be aware of? Shit attitude. Still resurrecting things. Someone feeling like they're in control of the situation. Mm. Someone isn't falling for that temptation. Could have been with a Capricorn. Someone has been falling for shit. Someone has been falling for temptation. Someone has been doing whatever. Pisces and cross watchers. Um, however, um, someone's ignoring their intuition here. It could be you, Pisces and cross watchers. If someone... Possibly is there some games kicking a no? <laughs> like whoever is avoiding the temptation, they're kicking the fuck out of this no because like, you know, some truth isn't flying out and that's why people can't agree or always disagreeing. You know, and the problem is is like, you know, this person's done this before. They know exactly what the fuck is up. Yeah, like this person isn't stupid. Like, they're lying. Like, invisibly so. They're not letting the bird fly. They just would rather agree to disagree with somebody, but that's only to hide the fact that that they really do know what the fuck they're doing. Like, like, they, like they, they've been talked about this before. They've been yelled at it. They've probably had a knife stabbed in their arm or two. Lord knows I've been there, but for different reasons. Um, <clears throat> but this person... Uh, Mm. Someone knows better. <laughs> Oof. 
Yeah. Someone isn't falling for this temptation. And this beware. So, Pisces and cross watchers, be very aware. I feel like this person might lose their shit. The minute you decide you're not going for the bullshit anymore, because it's just like, you know, like, okay, yeah, I, I understand the first 500 times, but how many times are you going to keep doing this before, like, you know, um, you ain't going to do it no more, like, you, you know. Um, you can only use the same excuse so long, and this person really is terrible at it. And plus, the King of Swords is out of here, too, so not only are they terrible at taking action and abhorrently cruel they say mean shit too they say mean shit queen of uh, and the queen of swords is up here and she's reversed too so yeah this is kind of a counterpart situation right here and whoever the counterpart is they're the block for this person they're blocking this person from continuing to ignore what the fuck's wrong with them like they're literally right here the judgment's right here they need to look at themselves but they don't want the foresight like hmm how everything results. Pisces and crowd watchers, you're probably pissed off because you've been sitting here waiting for a motherfucker who um, needs to apologize for sneakiness. Also, it could be you feeling this way. Hell, you might even be energy of waiting for somebody to come back because, you know, like, you want to apologize for some bullshit. Like, yeah. Better. Huh? Yeah, you better watch me. I'm listening to you. Who? Your boyfriend? No, I don't have him. Your girlfriend? I don't have that either. I'm getting him to Okay. It's working out. Good deal. Anyway. <laughs> I'll leave the Team Ranger alone. Let's see. Mm. <gasps> yeah, definitely counterparts involved here, man. This bitch is like, you know what? This wasn't that great of a big deal. I'm not even going to put the energy into being mad about this. I will not burn the kids' pets. I will not even invest the energy to be upset about this. I'm throwing this fish back in the water. That's what she's saying. This is definitely a counterpart energy. She just lets this go. Whoever's masculine in this energy, like, eh, I don't like them. They're lazy. This is all sideways, too. They could fix themselves or they could keep fucking around. They can make things work or they could keep, uh, you know, fucking around, honestly. Like, that's, that's really... They could embrace this relationship or they could let it go like they want to plan to do. Um, they could easily try to fix this stuff, but it's more like they'd rather just keep arguing. Um, they could easily get on this path where, like, they can be at a crossroads and fix shit, but they'd rather have someone enable them. Not really, like, to help fix anything, but just to keep them in place. So, I guess... Either they feel superior or in power or they or, or, or they matter or they need their work that way or something, you know. Like they like they can keep playing these games and feel good with it, or they can play these games and realize that whatever victories they cast, they're still gonna get the same fucking win. You know. Oh, you played basketball in high school? Did you ever play in college? Did you ever play professionally? Why you gotta keep playing against like fifth graders when you're thirty five years old? You don't like that kind of shit, right? Um, they could easily look on what to work on with this person that would make the statue more productive. The one, the image, the idol they created, or they could sit there and, and disregard it. Like I, I think they want to do. That's what this Queen of Cups is reflecting with this fish. That's what the fish represents. It's just like, you know, I haven't been through all this shit. I don't even know if I want to deal with this. I ra I'd rather go to Denny's. At least, <laughs> at least if I'm eating something, it'll be good, you know. Yeah, she probably wants to replenish herself and get back to work for the most part. I'll drop one more. They all got four anyway, so fuck it. Mm. Yeah, she'd rather work on something because honestly, it really gets tiring to fight a dragon at night. You know, that shit's annoying. <laughs> Plus they hover. Alright, so let's see. I gotta start doing fiber times. Yay. I will be on time for my zodiacs for once. I swear. <laughs> Maybe. Possibly.
Yeah, so there's really no commitment here with this person, or they just want to go against authority. Or even God. Let's just say God, since, like, you know, the higher things here. They're going to go against the universe. That's their whole thing. They think they can go against the universe. Um, and that's really what causes their problems. <laughs> this is someone um, who's going to regret getting exactly what they deserved. It's like the, it's like this person was warned. It's like they've been warned. They've been told shit before. But I, I, I don't know what the fuck. Ugh. People are so weird. It makes no sense to me. You know? You know, like they're gonna regret all the unfairness that went down. They're gonna be all paranoid about shit, and then they're gonna see that all their options have dried out after this whole debacle goes on. Pisces and Cross Watchers. It's like um, because this person is unable to change. Hmm. As long as their counterpart's going crazy, so when their counterpart leaves, but then by the time their counterpart leaves, that's when they realize, oh shit, I fucked up. Because that's normally how it works. Um, normally people don't realize what they have until it's gone, and then by that point it's just like, I can't believe I fucked up like that. Um, in this regard, though, I feel like it's going to be both parties, or all the parties, or however many people are in this orgy. I really don't know. There's a lot of people. Um, but I feel like, both parties are going to regret it because one might have really tried and the only one and the other one just kept making excuses to try, you know, or excuses not to um, do anything, you know, like the whole I can't mentality, which is like whatever um, really doesn't matter, though, does it? You know, there are women who say I can't pee standing up yet there are women out there who have trained themselves on how to pee standing up so it's a mentality thing anyway pisces and cross watchers that's your reading for the extended for this month love your faces i hope y'all have a good day and i will see you later bye bye